Hi friends, I am coming to you from beautiful southern Thailand where my wife Cindy and I are in the middle of a major creation with God project that uh, you'll hear more about later. But at the moment I'm in the middle of a run and I wanted to share this thought with you. Um, that I've been pondering for some time now because I just think it's so astounding. And that is, who do you think the first person in the Bible is where it's mentioned that God had filled that person with his spirit? It may not be who you think <clears throat> because the first mention of God saying, I have filled this person with my spirit is a man named Bezalel in the Old Testament in Exodus 31, as God was giving instructions to Moses about building the tabernacle. And God says that he has filled Bezalel with his spirit in order to do crafts work and artistic design. <clears throat> and then he goes on to explain in great detail the colors of the fabrics and which metals to use <clears throat> and every aspect of the aesthetic design of this tabernacle and it just shows how much God is into artistic creation uh, because he is a creator he created us in his image and so we are made to create and as we read these chapters uh, all about this creation of the tabernacle we see over and over how God had very specific ideas in mind about every artistic uh, piece and every color uh, and every fabric and every material used to make this tabernacle. And we also notice that unlike the beautiful natural creation that's behind me and <clears throat> that you may see around you, uh, which was only done by God, in this case, he is saying, this is how I want you to do it. I have the design, I have the colors in mind, I want you to co-create with me to create this beautiful tabernacle that we're going to make together. And I just think that is such a beautiful picture of the creative heart of God and how he wants us to partner with him in that. <clears throat>